All right, this is a Eufy vacuum cleaner, and I'm going to show you how to replace the brushes and the filters, clean the brushes and clean the filters. I'm going to show you how I do it. All right, so I have the Eufy vacuum cleaner upside down, belly side up, and I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to take off these uh, side sweeping brushes and then replace them with new ones. All right, so I'm going to come right here, and you see these are the brushes. Now, to take these off, you simply just, I just simply grab them by the hairs and just tug them upwards like that. You see how I tug them upwards and they come off. There's no screwing or anything necessary, necessary to take these off. So once I take them off, I can clean them with my cleaning tool, clean them, or if they need to be replaced, take them and then put them back into place like this. Just push them down and they snap into place just like that. So you clean them just like that. The next is the main roller brush, which is located in the center. So what I do with this is I just come up to this, press this this way, and pull up the guard. Any hair debris, clean that off of there. And then I take the main roller brush. You see how it comes in right here? I'm going to take this and just pull it up, and it comes up. And you see on both sides there are different shapes, and you can figure out how, to, how they go back in. So once I take this off, typically pull all the hair use you know this tool right here which is razor cut the hair or whatever off like that cut off the hair get off all the dust and dirt and stuff like that make sure there's nothing caught up in here and then just simply replace it by taking the roller brush putting it back into this socket right here make sure it lines up in there once it lines up in there all right this place, this part just slides back into place, and I'm able to take this and put this back into place right here. And it snaps back in like this. Did you see that? All right, so I have the roller brush cleaned, replaced, new one. And then next, I have this at the bottom right here. This is the dustbin. Now, to get to the dustbin, there is a little lever right here you see this right here i have it upside down now if you have it upside up you just right side up you just simply press this down and pull it out okay but i have it upside down so i'm gonna pull it up like this and then pull it out now once i have this out all right i'm going to make sure i have the bin emptied before i make a mess everywhere so you empty the bin by coming up right here uh oops i didn't do it right okay come up right here Flip it right side up, open this lever right here, and then go dump the dust out into the rubbish. All right, so once you dust it out in the rubbish and you need to clean this, you can simply wipe this down. And then there is some pre-filters. There may be some dust on here. This is the pre-filter. Now, if you want to take this out, run some water on it or anything like that, just simply come up here. These bars are here. Just simply pull them up, and you can take this get the excess dust off, maybe run it under some water to get the get the, get it clean, maybe take a dry brush and brush it off or whatever. This is the pre-filter. And then here is the main filter. Now you can't access this from this part right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and replace this, all right? And then we're going to get to the actual filter after I replace this. All right, so I'm going to get this and Put it back into place. Locks back into place. And then go ahead and shut this. And then I'm going to flip this upside down. Now, once this is upside down, you see I, I can't really access it through there. There's this part right here where it says insert this side up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, pull this back, and it exposes the pre-filter and this mesh filter that goes on the pre-filter. So I take this off. Sometimes I can just tap this and get some dust off. But uh, occasionally it will come so worn down and worn out and dirty that I have to replace this. And so what I do is I discard this, get the replacement, make sure this black part is on here. Put this right here. Now there is a little tab right here. Put this into place like that. Open it back up, slide it back in here, and just just simply push it down. 
and just make sure oh, I didn't I didn't put that in right so pull it back out put it in place push it down and then put this filter back on top like right here all right so once I have that on top close this come back here and if you want it to be e going easily flip it back right side up and then take this and slide it in place like that all right and you're ready to go all right i hope this video was helpful thanks a lot for watching